Welcome to Jets Talk. My name's Ryan. I'll be your pilot today. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button. If you've been here before, welcome back. I love having you here. Guys, I said I'd be giving away a shirt, so I think we know which style of shirt is going to be given away today. Dick Long, you are going to be our commenter from the live stream that's going to be winning a shirt. Uh, hurry up, liquor stores close at 10. Pretty much describes last night's game. I would say last night's game is about as embarrassing as you can get on a nationally televised stage without a butt fumble. I could not have been more wrong across the board on anything. <laughs> I mean, my Jakai Polite take real high on that one. I'm batting about a thousand right now for my uh, my hot takes, so uh, not good. Team ghosts. I don't like what I saw out of Sam Darnold. Obviously, a lot of turnovers. I think the offensive line is a big part of that. You know, receivers couldn't catch the ball. Uh, the defense just couldn't stop the passing attack of the Patriots or the rushing attack of the Patriots. They just did whatever they wanted to us. And, you know, it was embarrassing from start to finish. ESPN caught that um, seeing ghosts comments. Are, are you, how do you feel about that? What, did you, what were you thinking then? What can you share about that? Yeah, you know, I think, I think for me, I just got to, you know, just uh, when, I, when I talk to the coaches, I just got to be, you know, straight up. And, you know, for me, um, I just got to see the field a lot better. That's kind of what that means. And, um, you know, just it was, it was a rough day out there, rough night out there. And obviously I got to be better and learn from the mistakes, uh, but we, we will get better. Sam Darnold said he was seeing ghosts, which is an entirely different issue. If he is seeing a pass rush without a pass rush actually being there, you know, that's not good. He's getting the happy feet. I don't think he was able to step into a throw all night. Every Every interception that he had, he was, you know, he had a weird balance or a weird, you know, throwing position. It just, he was making bad decisions. It was across the board, just not good. You know, there, we didn't really get to see much of a sighting from any of our star players. I mean, Tremaine Johnson got an interception, but that game was over after the first drive. I mean, you watch the Patriots just run down our throats. It was like 16 plays in like nine minutes. It was just like, I mean, I don't know. There's no way that I could have ever seen that coming. I mean, I expected it to be close. I wouldn't have, you know, been shocked with a loss. Obviously, I felt the Jets should have won this game, but it's very clear and very evident that we are so far behind the Patriots. And, you know, if we play like that, we're going to be behind by a lot of teams. And then you have Bill Belichick, you know, having a delay of game to try and push back a punt. We decide to decline it because we want to try and get that punt into the end zone. And then he tells his guys to false start and you get this smirk from Bill Belichick. So the page just such a kick in the dick. It really is. <laughs> As a Jet fan, I'm not real high right now. This is <laughs> this is very, very tough to swallow and it's hard for me to get amped up about other games, you know, moving forward when you see this kind of effort and this kind of beatdown. Guys, let me know what you thought of the game down below. And as always, go Jets. J -E -T -S, J -E -T -S.